am Les. This is my wife, Rhonda. We're the bachelors. We live in Magna, Utah, and this is our bathroom. The bathroom itself had basically no character, no storage. It was just plain and blah. We decided to renovate our bathroom. What kicked the whole thing off is my wife had shown me some pictures of what she wanted in a magazine, what kind of what she was looking for, and then she found at the ReStore a uh, marble countertop for ten dollars. Just this beautiful marble countertop and we designed uh, the whole bathroom around that. The surround around our mirrors, for instance, all that wood, most of it's from the ReStore, all been recycled. We built it all from scratch. Well, almost everything is from a second-hand store or something that we already had. There were a few challenges, but one that really sticks out in my mind is for our mirror, there was just one big solid build-a-grade mirror, and we'd taken that down, and then for the vanity, we cut into the wall, and we marked out on the wall exactly where we were going to put it and have the three bays for the medicine cabinet, and we got to the last one, and there was a pipe. You see this lip right here? That covers up the pipe is actually right in here, and we just kind of like pushed it over as far as we could and made this lip. So it kind of actually the door rests against it, but it turned out pretty good. You wouldn't even know if I didn't point it out to you. Our original vanity had only one sink and faucet in it because we had an extra six inches we could play with. We decided to make our new one a little bit bigger and put a double sink in it. But by doing that, we didn't have a place to put the scale. So I came up with the idea of building a garage to slide it into. Another feature that I really like are these latches. I love them. They add a lot of character. The floor I think adds a lot. We love the floor. It's a shelf I already had and then my husband made this other shelf to match it with the top one. And we filled it with a lot of accessories that we pretty much got at secondhand stores. About the only thing that we paid full price for was our faucets. And uh, that was disappointing to us, but we got over it. It took us about a year to do the whole remodel. When we took everything out and put it in the basement for our boys' bathroom, we thought, okay, we'll hurry and do it. But it, we have six children, so it took us a long time to get in here on the weekends and nights and squeeze it in. So it took us over a little, about a year. I vaguely remember her telling me she had entered us in a contest, but I forgot about that some time ago. And when she told me that we had won, I didn't quite know what that had meant. <laughs> I was excited and I called him and he just couldn't believe because I read this old house magazine all the time and I also watch the TV show so I was really excited to know that I was going to be in that magazine. How we come up with most of our designs for the rooms and the things that we do in our house, usually we kind of have a general idea of what we want but I'll come up with the designs and my wants and dreams and draw pictures um, or show her magazine pictures and collage with those and I show them to him and then he builds it. We help together to install it and we come up with things that we really love and they're really fun because then we feel like we put our blood, sweat, and tears in it. Literally. <laughs>